Some exciting news out of Hearst Castle tonight. Renovations to the Neptune pool are complete. It's being filled with water permanently for the first time in four years. KSBY News reporter Alexa Bertola was there and has this story. The pool started filling up around 8.30 this morning. It'll take roughly two days to complete. The Neptune pool is one of the most iconic features at the castle. Uh, one of the most viewed and one of the most photographed. The wait is over. After two years of work on the iconic Neptune pool, it'll be filled to the brim. I think it's spectacular, you know, to, to see the, the water going in and uh, the amount of water that's needed to fill up that pool. The pool will hold 345,000 gallons of water. Tourists snap photos of the history before their eyes. It's just thrilling to be here and especially with the pool being filled. In 2014, it was drained. Two years later, construction got underway to fix two major cracks and about 180 leaks. We were losing anywhere from, you know, three to 5,000 gallons a day. Now not only leak proof, the new pool is keeping the history alive with tiling from the same quarry in Vermont that sourced the original pool. Every one of these tiles is laid by hand. Um, every one of these cracks has been, you know, checked and, and reviewed. On the outskirts, it has revamped statues. It's monstrous, but it's the, the materials that it's constructed from that are just so fantastic. You know, the marble and the, the surfaces. When Mr. Hurst built it originally, or was, when it was originally built in the 1920s, it was a much smaller pool. Um, it was expanded two times um, to what we have today. If you're wondering, it's three feet in the shallow end and 10 feet in the deep end. It's 104 feet long and 58 feet wide. A major undertaking finally brought back to its glory. It's a once in a lifetime opportunity to, to take on this project and, and hopefully it'll, it'll last uh, for another 100 years. And the project has a price tag of $5.4 million. At the Hearst Castle Neptune Pool, I'm Alexa Bertola for KSBY News.